Finally, finally, finally! But of course, we are back with another Beyblade video. Beyblade video. Beyblade. Beyblade. So yeah, um, Beyblade, we're back with another video for that. It's been a good, actually a long minute since I did one, so I think it's been about, what, like a month now-ish? Um, maybe a couple months? Two, three? Um, I think, what's the last one I did? Was it like back in like December, I think? December? I can't, I can't remember the month, so, um, yeah. I did get some new info slash news for the new surprise, of course. Uh, we got some for Vault, we got some for, um, the new, of course, you know, um, Louis Bay, we got a new Lunar, we got a new Fafnir, like, it's already pretty much confirmed coming, so I think Fafnir and Lunar are first, then I think they'll slowly go up to Shu and, of course, Vault, so yeah, for the Japanese dub for, um, Diamond Battle, so we had the full info right here and stuff like that. I'll probably upload this as soon as I can, maybe, because, again, I have so many other videos to upload, but I want to try to prioritize Beyblade first, because, you know, people that do videos on it, maybe it's, like, one or two, and that's pretty much it. Um, then my videos get like what, almost like 100 plus views, so I might as well just, you know, um, you know, just do more. It's not because of the views and stuff like that. I, I am not a, I'm not that type of person to be greedy, but I'm saying in general though, because when, whenever, like, I do videos on this, they blow up out of nowhere. I'm like, wow, I guess no one did a video for it, so I might as well just do it myself. Or, you know, people just do still, again, because anyway, like that in content creation, like, where they make, like, any other video, whatever they do, you know, people don't do, and they still watch it, so, I don't know. I figured I, you know, get some, you know, um, Extra, you know, view in my pocket if, if necessary. You know, I gotta steal the view wing world. I'm kidding though. Um, I'm just saying in general though, I might as well just do it because, you know, since I'll, no, no one's gonna really cover it or it's gonna be just dead to time for a couple of days or months, I might as well just do it myself, you know. No, like, get my version, like, get my counterpoint and stuff like that. The whole point of continuation, kids. The whole point of YouTube so you can do whatever you want. I'm kidding though. Ignore everything I said before. We got a new shoe bay, of course. We got a new vault bay right here. Um, I was into like this. I was like, this is actually really perfect though. So of course we got shoot new bait the S for surprising, the route trick. We have the full details right here. I'm gonna we'll link all these images below for you guys so you can see for yourself. Um pretty much I got them off from the Beyblade Reddit, so I'll just go, you know, find the image and stuff like that. Um because I think all these below is gonna be like a mass massive, massive nuke in a box. So yeah. Um it seems like surprising's gonna have like what's you know, the dual wielding pieces right here, like it always usually does. Um can I actually zoom a little bit more? Let me zoom in a little bit more. Um I zoomed actually pretty perfect right here. Um, of course, we got shoe back. We already seen it from the Coral Coral leaks. It going down like eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Uh, I think Louis. I think and shoe and like um, free like the last ones ish. So yeah, of course, that's surprising the dual like surprising. Seems like it's gonna have like you know sparking like kind of chip like always oh, happened like the beginning. That sparking chip like the whole you know first you know chip they had like in like what um back in a little bit like. God or like evolution, so yeah, that's gonna be that there. It seems like it's gonna have a little bit. I see some white right there, I see some black right here in gold and yellow. Um, seems like the parts right here, the wedges, like you know, for his like axe. Um, I see like because you know, back you know, it was like red, that one was like orange. This one will probably be like white, I think. It's not like gonna be white and orange. I can kind of see, I feel like I can kind of see some of the colors right here a little bit. Seems like she was basically gonna be pretty solid and straightforward, you know, typical red, black, you know, the match character design and stuff like that. They always do that for all of these bay plates, anyways. Though, but then of course, we go back to volts. Um, it's weird because we don't like we didn't get a voucher at all, voucher at all this time first, so it's like okay, it's still in development. So we got um, this right here. So it's gonna have like you know three swords, but then it's gonna have three other two other mini swords with it. That's completely new for Valtry. Of course, at the V right there, I can see the blue, I can see the gold slash um, I can see the gold, I can see the um, blue right there. Um, I can see I think another white piece right there. It seems like it. Of course, got the oh, it looks like it's gonna have a big V Valtry symbol right there. I see some more yellow right there, some more red. Um, right here, it seems like they're all connected right here. The blue the little core in there. I see some more stuff. I see, yeah, I see like the extra white piece. I can see more better down here. It looks like I got some dragon vibes on here. Some red right here where I'm pointing. Yellow. Um, it looks like I got some more stuff down there though. It actually looks really nice for it though. Um, so yeah, it's like that's gonna have the whole, you know, new, um, Diamond Battle system and stuff like that where it has like the little, you know, extra pieces right here. It's, I was saying it's like GT Con 2.0. Then you have that little extra layer piece for from this tip. Which we have already got revealed already though. So yeah, this actually seems really nice right here though. I actually do like it myself. So yeah, um, let's back this up a little bit more. Um, of course, the next Beyblade that were revealed were the Lunar. Seems like we got that. Of course, we got Bell's new Bay, which we already seen already pretty much from the leaks. We got um, uh, Louis down there as well. Um, let me see. Yeah, Bell's new Bay. We already know about that already. I don't know the name of that Beyblade though, so, so don't be like, oh, you know the Beyblade name, which is okay. I don't. I just don't know. Okay. Yeah. Um, but yeah, seems like Louis's new Bay seems like it's gonna be like a Lunar. No, a Lunar though. Um, like it always is. I feel stupid for saying that because it's always Lunar. Um. Or long in this, whatever, Japanese name, whatever. Both, both the same names. Yeah, it seems like you can't really see the colors kind of here. They feel kind of muted right here, though. You guys probably see a little bit better than me. I'm, for me, I'm ducking down because, again, my computer screen's like white back, crunched over for me when I'm recording like this. And for you guys, it's probably just straightforward, you know, stress about that. 
So for me, I can kind of see, because I've been nowhere here, actually, it looks better. I see some gold right there, the eyes for um, Lunor, the dragon head right there. The um, you know, three dragon head that swirl around um, for the um, chip. Um, of course, Lunar with lances and stuff like that. Of course, the metal lances it always has. But colors are more muted here. I can barely even see any colors here. So, yeah, this is the Priscilla wedding. They did a really good job. I can see some more white right here. Blue right here. I see the dragon head a little bit. It's going to be more in the focus for my eyes. Um, dragon head. I see the dragon eyes right there. Um, it seems like they did a really good job revealing because we don't know nothing about these Beyblades at all. Like, we haven't seen them like this. Of course, our Trix colors got it. Completely spoiled from the next couple images, anyway, though. So, yeah, okay, right. Yeah, it's just like Rage Longinus used as a um, placeholder. Okay, so, okay. Oh, they just Rage Longinus used. Okay, so. Oh, okay, so they basically just use a lot of placeholders. Um, okay, that's. Okay, I've, I didn't read that before at all, so, okay, that's really different, I guess. Um, yeah, it seems like they're gonna. Okay, okay, yeah. I think I see a little Rage Longinus stuff, but again, they could just. Again, each place has a place. I think, okay, even, I think even Voucher. But I don't know, Voucher, I can, um, Shoes may look completely new because they don't say placeholders here. So whoever translated this, they put the plate on this. I guess they just didn't have time. I, I feel like they put Rage Longest here because obviously they didn't have time to put it in here. I mean, because they weren't doing the design yet for it. So, I mean, it kind of looks like Rage Longest. I can kind of see it, though. Yeah, I can definitely see it, actually. Um, I can definitely see it here now. I can definitely, definitely see it there. So, um, yeah. Um, again, though, again, they just use it as a placeholder. I didn't know that though, before. Um, so we got the new bay for this guy. Well, I don't know his name at all. So it's going to be like a teal like pegasus i guess right here again i haven't seen the anime at all yeah yeah fafnir just got revealed right there it's like oh yeah you want a fafnir here you go so yeah i'm like they have like blades more on the outer shell right here outer side shell outer layer right there someone's gonna have more um blades right there um for it it does have some green in there as well um we can't kind of see it here we see like kind of like a you know the creature like you know for all the bay blades you know always like the creature's kind of bond with the bay with itself like a fafnir you know has like you know drag in the middle but it has like the drag hits on the side or as well as rubber I feel like this one's gonna be like a bird like blade one. This one's gonna have some phoenix slash, you know, um, just Bahamut like vibes. That's what I kind of get from this armor like right here. This one's gonna be an armor gimmick, maybe. Um, or like a bladed kind of like gimmick right here. I can just scroll up. Come up armor or whatever kind of bladed like gimmick right there. It seems like it's gonna be like really right there. So, um, that's how um, I feel like it's gonna be structured right there for it. So, it seems like it's gonna be honestly really good though. But also, we can also see like, you know, more things improve or other things, you know, go on like with this Beyblade. So, again, nothing like just yet though. But we're gonna see more stuff get revealed in the future though. So, um, probably next couple of like months or weeks or whatever, we're gonna see it. Or as the anime goes on, they're like, okay, we're gonna reveal this Bay. Like, they're gonna not reveal the Bay in the anime, but they're gonna reveal it right here. Then they're gonna put it in the anime. They, they did this with Helios and Hyperion. We got the new evolutions. They revealed them first here in the Core Core Leaks. Then they revealed them in the anime. Because we already know the bay is gonna break anyway, though. Every main character's bay blade has broken. Not bolt, it's just performance got broken, but you can still technically count that. But I mean, we already know how surprising it ended up and so all that. Yeah, I mean, Shu technically was the main character. Technically, I'm just kidding. Um, he kind of was low key before Bolton came on, which surprising did get destroyed though. So yeah, because I think him, him and Louis like final battle, uh, surprising got stripped in half. Then, then years later, God or Evolution, she was like, ha ha, payback boy, surprising. Flash just destroyed that man. So yeah, I know I was like I just I thought of that about I just thought of that now. I was like, oh my god, I just thought of that like right now though. Like just I was surprised the Requiem just you know slashing it in half. So I was like, yeah, payback so yeah, Fafnir just got straight up reveal. Of course, we got more rubber parts right here. Uh, we got more of the you know, new kind of layer piece right there as well. It seems like we're in the, you know, the metal piece, um, new layer um, system or, you know, a chip where um, the diamond battle chip where it's a place right there. Uh, we're going to know they're revealing the anime first and they're going to reveal the bay plates. We've seen this kind of time and time again. So we're definitely going to see that more, a little bit more. Um, yeah, it seems like Fafnir is just simple and easy to the point. You already know Dragon Heads has going to have rubber over here. Um, some more yellow, some more blue right there. Of course, we got green in it with, green in it with, with, it, green in it with this time. So we get mixing up the colors because usually it's like you know yellow and blue and that's pretty much it then like the red eyes with the dragon heads but this number one team that's gonna have some different type of you know i don't know again like kind of yeah because it's free right there and stuff like that of course resembling more of the character this time around so yeah but it seems to pretty simple to the point uh of course we got the claw gimmick i guess like our voucher we have the um, okay it's all the bayblades right here so yeah um you see like the new gimmick for right here it seems like it's gonna have like a tonic of for voucher i think it's gonna have like rubber right here and it's gonna have like you know the primitive gimmick like it always has where like it's not like basically not final drive mode or you know it's gonna have like a claw like right here and kind of like you know it's gonna like you know it doesn't seem like this piece not gonna be is not gonna be rubber it might be just plain plastic or whatever but if it is rubber and you know you battle with it it seems like this tip right here is flat i guess we rip it and battle with it you're gonna see like you know that tip kind of you know wear out like every voucher tip has worn out then when it goes to like it's limit it'll go faster and it'll like you know use more of these claws 
well as like right here when it's um, ripping. We have the middle piece right there for the layer, and of course we got the you know other. Um, it's not like it's gonna be rubber right there for Valtteri, so we kind of see some more stuff right there. Um, seems like Bell's Bay is gonna be doing the same thing as well. Okay, that's interesting right here. Okay, yeah, it seems like okay. Oh yeah, because any every new baby that's gonna have like a, a variant mode or whatever, or like you know you can remove off this piece. The factory's piece is right here. It seems like you're gonna take that off. And, like factory right here, you can take it off and put it back on and customize like back and forth. It seems like yeah, you can take that um the piece off because I think it's kind of like two modes, like outbreak or you know output mode or like raid or berserk or whatever mode. Because I think there's a trying to make mode changes with these baby blades, so we're gonna kind of see it though, of course. Um. Sim is gonna be revealed like that this time around. So again, it's 2021, like late 2021. We know it's gonna be like all oh, May and June and July. That's why they mainly big have all the big Beyblade Bay reveals in the summertime because you know summer tournaments and stuff like that. Kids are so to slowly get back into school. You know, people are starting to do tournaments and stuff like that again. Um, because again, kids are getting back to school, so we probably gonna see. You know, I think TwitchCon slash PAX is coming back as well. Um, again, um. So I'll put with gaming, some more Sonic stuff if you uh, miss that Sonic content. Um, just more little stuff like that, of course, we've seen kind of go around, like the news and stuff like that. So we can kind of see some of this stuff kind of surface up. Again, it's going to be online only, though, so yeah. I, I keep forgetting a little bit, the, the series with its gimmick, this gimmick series is going to be like kind of mode changing, like changing different modes and stuff like that, of course. Um, of course, right here, I think it's more of the same image I kind of showed earlier. Is that? Okay, yeah, the same image though, of course. Seems like it's gonna be like Bell's Bay that had the same type of performance tip. It seems like it's gonna be like revealing off the other main characters. It seems like Bell Director's gonna be a clone this time, not the main character! <laughs> ah, so, um, seems like it's gonna have the same performance tip. I think the image we saw before, the, um, you know, customizable piece or customizable part at the bottom for, um, Bell's Bay right there. Um, it is the same part as well, I guess, like the new modes, like you can change and stuff like that. You know, I guess you can use other Beyblades, like the other Beyblades that got revealed, you can use their parts on these parts as well, so, yeah. Okay, we got some more Beyblades for Hasbro. A couple more here. Um, this one is, I think, Helios, and I can't really see because these images are completely just not even good. It seems like we got World Surprising right there. It seems like it's gonna have Metal in it this time around. Um, not the performance tip. Though. I think the performance tip is different as well. It's like it's not like it's not like Mirage Fafnir or nothing because it literally does nothing. Um, so we got another Helios, but I can't. Sorry, I don't have the time. I can't tell because they look exactly the same. I think this is um, Hyperion. The Helios, Helios is the left one, Hyperion's the right one. Yeah, as soon as we have like the um, disc and stuff like that, of course, and the, of course, the metal arm, um, you know, performance and stuff like that. I did get my rough fat does. I, I can't confirm it does actually have rubber on it though, so. Yeah, perhaps, bro. I got it myself like on my birthday on March 17th, so. Got that myself. So yeah, um, seems like we're getting World Surprise with metal on it. That's good right there. So yeah, that's actually really, really good right there. Um, again, these are all by the base we kind of got right now. These are only the Im leaked images we have. We have no clear other images for it right now, like clearly. So this is the best uh, we have to do right now with all these images though. So yeah, there's some good stuff right there. Um, we got more Beyblades right here. It seems like we got a new um, Faf and uh, oh my lord, a Luonor right here. Um, it seems like it's gonna be what, Mirage Luonor? Is, or like, um, it looks like, um, Hyper, um, not Hyper Hyperion. Um, so it's gonna have, yeah, Hyperion's, of course, this performance tip destroy dash, or it seems like it's gonna be, I can't remember what performance tip was at. I know it's definitely Luonor. The colors look really weird, though. The red and yellow and blue they look kind of really weird, honestly. It looks okay, maybe I gotta get used to it, but when I see this, so I'm like, oh, this is kind of really weird. It looks really, really weird. I don't know why. But, um, yeah, though, um, it seems like it's gonna have, you know, the blue, like, it seems it's gonna have, like, at least it's Hyperions, I think. It does say burn, because it was at, like, four layers. I think it's, um, Helios is, um, it has to be Helios. Um, what was Helios' first name? Something Helios. Never, uh, I forgot other, Helios' other name. I, I can really forgot about it. So it's gonna have Helios' piece, because that's, um, only, the only left spin chip we have right now. Because, we you know, with, um, I think with Helios, we have, like, him, we have his, like, chip, right, sparking chip. And we also have, um... Luminor, I mean, we have a Fafnir's piece right here, like his rubber gimmick, because you can absorb spin technically with that bay as well. But I think it's gonna have like um, Helios right here. So it's gonna have Helios' um, left spin um, blading gimmick uh, with the Luminor right there, because again, they're both, both left spin, um, left spins. And on top of that, if you. Um... There are bags on there. But yeah, um, it seems like that um, it's going to have. Um, Helios gimmick and stuff like that with the, um, you know, sparking chips in the middle and stuff like that. Um, of course we got another Beyblade, I think it has drones or something like that. Um, so like, um, has Lunar's old, I mean, uh, Lunar's performance tip. Um, I think it's like Doomsizer, I think? I think it's Doomsizer, I think. I think it's Doomsizer. I'm um, coming back or, um, 
I'm um, coming back for like the series and stuff like that because they did this before with the last series. You know, we all we got um, Dago coming back and then we got Lot Walkie come back instead. Um, but it seems like this is gonna be Doom Sizer right here. I think it's Doom Doom Sizer because the whole scythe right there like always has the whole skeleton Grim Reaper kind of game. Uh, brought back for um, Speed Storm, Speed Storm. So um, they did this before with the Tech Guy Tommy. So they're gonna probably do it back here just to have that version of it. And of course we got Helios Peace with um, Lunar Rifle Peace right there. So yeah, that's all the um, new we got. We got Royal Surprise in um, a new um, Lunar kind of combination with Helios. Of course we got Doom Sizer coming back. I specifically think they said they did that. We got all the new bays, all the new gimmicks and stuff like that coming up soon. We got all the new leaks, all the new images for all the new characters and stuff like that. For all the Coral Coral leaks and stuff like that. So, yeah, it seems like okay, both going back to his original design because he had sleeves in the last series. So for both. He's going back full on original. Cause that's why I was like, wait, is he, is he copy and pasting his design? But no, they're going back to his original design completely. That is insane. I just noticed that. Yeah, I think like Sarah's gonna go back to original design. Louis has like his kind of like cape thing from like his first season. She has like his cloak like from Turbo and stuff like that. Free just doing whatever he wants. So, what did Free do? Oh yeah, to be continued. So we gotta reveal more stuff later uh, in the future. So yeah, seems like I'll probably go ahead and end the video here. I feel like that's pretty much I want to talk about everything though. Uh, we got customizable parts, more um turbo stuff coming up, uh, more demo battle stuff coming up though. So it seems like um yeah, both going back to original design. I just noticed that. Um, seems like some of them are going back to original design. Louis has his cape thing, of course. Um, Bell has his of course, you know, bait and stuff like that, of course, you know, the demon bear, whatever. So yeah, gonna go ahead and end the video here. I feel like I talked long, talked on long enough already. Did everything I could. So yeah. I'll leave the stuff with that right here. So yeah, see you guys there though. Thank you for watching. Have a great day, great life. All cool and good now. Make sure I stay safe. Watch your hands. God bless all of you. If you're going up, I'm a mess. Do some clip here. Do whatever you want. I'm just joking. Put it all in the video. So yeah, what you gotta think about these gimmicks and bases and stuff like that? Do you like it? Do you hate it? There's so much going on. There's so much going on for Beyblade right now. Not as much like for news wise, but we got some pretty good stuff here. Didn't mean to make the video go on this this long, but um, I pretty much feel like I got everything pretty much I wanted to roll up into one now. So. Yeah, got all the information I need though. So yeah, see you guys later. Okay, no, it's out.